This is a Stanford student literally falling asleep in one of the world's most difficult classes. And this is me, a student at a school no one has heard of, eager to see what a day in the life of students at an elite university is actually like. To find out, I'll be spending the day with my friend Addie. Me and Addie are friends from high school. We are currently at a bus stop about to take a bus to his first class. This is one of the largest campuses in the world. So where are we headed now? We are headed to the medical school for my first class. We are on East Campus right now and we're headed to West Campus. In high school, Addie was in the top 1% of our class with a 5.1 GPA, won several awards for his science and engineering research, and even got his pilot's license. So his upcoming routine today definitely took me by surprise. We're running 10 minutes late already, so not a great start. <laughs> oh, so true. <laughs> Look at this. We're in the elevator now, and there is some motivation on the wall. Yeah, I look at it every day. Entering the class, we took the last remaining seats near the front. And while my goal is to actually follow along, I quickly realized that this probably wasn't possible when I saw the first slide. There was almost no white space with arrows pointing in every direction and a ton of medical terms that I've never heard before. So while I still did my best to pay attention and learn something, all I could take away from the first 30 minutes was that they didn't like the FDA. Even though I had no idea what was going on, I still had to act like I did because I didn't want to get exposed or kicked out. But Addy wasn't too concerned himself and was actually shopping for a Tesla. We just got out of my first Stanford class. I've never seen so much crammed into a single slide before. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that happens a lot. <laughs> Addy was just on his phone the entire time. <laughs> what? Wait, oh. everyone is usually like on the computer or on the phone. As long as you're like paying attention to the content, like it's, it's fine. There's no way you were paying attention. What? That's crazy. Actually, Loki, you were paying more attention. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. Your eyes were focused on the slide. I think you paid the most attention out of any student <laughs> in that room. Where are we headed now? We are headed to lunch. One of my favorite eating places on campus. Probably actually my favorite. It's called Blend. This place is, it's like Chipotle, but for like more like Asian style food. The only thing I don't like about it is usually there is a long line. Usually like 20 30 minutes but real good food we just got our meals from blend after waiting in line for about 20 minutes but hopefully it's worth the wait it looks pretty good i got the beef with brown rice and some veggies we're also joined by my friend daniel who is in my week in the life at babson college we went to school together after we finish eating we're gonna go to the student union to study i'm not studying but addy uh -huh. will study what do you have to study i don't know research but sure sure you research the price of teslas <laughs> <laughs> During the hours leading up to our next class, Addy actually did do some pretty elaborate research. I can't show exactly what he was doing, but basically he was analyzing patient health data and running models to predict the future risk of heart diseases and prevent them from occurring, while I was just editing a YouTube video. What do you think of Addy? I think he's way smarter than me, and it makes sense why he's at the school. I also think he's really nice and welcoming, which I appreciate. And at this time, I was also introduced to one of his friends. Hi, my name is Shreya, I'm a junior. So I work in the Cardiovascular Research Center, and so I'm doing an experiment where I'm able to take heart transplants from the hospital and take the tissue and slice it up really thinly, and instead of cells, use the sliced tissue in my experiments. What is your major called? I'm actually the same major as him. <laughs> And you don't do that? I do not do it. This is like wet lab work, which I don't do. I stick to like computational work on the lane. Do you think you study harder than Addy? <laughs> my own weeks where I just like brain rot. So <laughs> tomorrow I got an offer to go and get a manicure and that overlaps with the class I'm taking. So I don't think I'll attend that one. <laughs> we are now heading to Addy's second and final class of the day. What's it called? It is called cloud computing for biology and healthcare. And it starts in five minutes, but I don't think we're five minutes away. I think we're much further away. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're a little bit late. But we also took a detour because Addy started craving hot chocolate. I need something for the walk. <laughs> so we're about to get hot chocolate now. 
I've actually never been late to a college class before in my four years in college. And now and you are. <laughs> this is my first one ever being late for. Yay, I'm a great student. Addy is a great influence. <laughs> well, I did my best to pay attention in the first class. This one was even more complicated to comprehend. And because we were sitting in the back of a lecture hall, I felt less pressure to fake it and just started watching YouTube while Addy scrolled through Instagram reels. Still, I did participate in the professor's knowledge check where she had everyone complete some multiple choice questions about what had just been discussed. And I actually got one right. And the one I got wrong, almost the entire class got wrong too, which was proof that no one knew what was going on and it wasn't just me. After that, I continued watching YouTube and eventually looked over to see that Addy had completely fallen asleep. But it's methods so that we can understand the biological more, much more quantitatively. This is also not the first time I've fallen asleep in class. Hey, what did we learn in class? Tell me. Was I snoring? <laughs> no, 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 no. I was trying so hard not to laugh at the end. I was like holding everything together. I usually don't care, but last time he was sitting right next to me, and I was like, no, you're not falling asleep. So I like, jabbed him like twice, yeah, and he woke up. He's a great student, though. I slept really well. Hey, I'm a great student. This is Addy's friend, Pooja. Hi. Did you purposely wear this to look like a minion? <laughs> no. <laughs> you know what, it's fine. I'm gonna wear it anyway. <laughs> Did you learn anything in class? I uh, learned that when you don't know an answer to a question, you mark all of the above. I did that too. I... It was 50% right, so like, it's a good shot. When we were so horribly wrong, I felt like really bad. I was like, oops. I just saw her reaction. It was like, oh, we didn't even talk about yeah. that one. <laughs> <laughs> After class, we ate dinner at Addy's favorite Thai restaurant called Typhoon, and now it is time for a dorm tour. My um, dorm is Bobby themed, as you can see. The room is a mess. There are three guys living in this room, so it's kind of expected. Hopefully, maybe it's a mess. Anyway, <laughs> welcome to the dorm. This is a common room. We have a dining table filled with stuff I need to throw out, the kitchen, and kind of living space <laughs> with one free couch and a chair full of stuff. This is not the cleanest room, but yeah, very spacious. This is a bedroom. My bed. This is my desk, which as you can see, I do not use at all to study. It is merely just there. I tend to study on my bed. <laughs> or not at all. We have to clean. Anyways, we have a closet and we have a bathroom for the two of us. Unnecessarily large. Again, a mess. There's a mouse. There is a mouse. It's my roommate's mouse. He wanted it to scare people off during Halloween and then he really liked it. And he's not letting me get rid of it, even though I want to throw it in the garbage. This is a beautiful, clean mirror here. Well, thank you for the tour. You're welcome. Where are we going next? We are headed to play squash in the gym. All right. Let's go. We are now heading to the gym to play squash, which I've actually never played before, but hopefully Addy doesn't beat me too bad. <laughs> I'm so sweating now. We just played five rounds of squash. Yeah. I got smoked the first four rounds, but that was just me warming up because I won the last round by two points. How do you feel? Dead. <laughs> Where are we going now? We are heading to what's called the On Call Cafe. It's a student run cafe. It's a great place to just like hang out and get like really nice and affordable drinks. Are you gonna miss not having your day recorded when I leave? I will miss you. Aw. Um, day recorded? Loki, if my day wasn't recorded, probably would have slept. <laughs> okay, we are back in the dorm now. What are your parents gonna think when they watch this? I hope they don't watch this. <laughs> would you say that this represents an accurate day in your life? <laughs> I think it was pretty accurate. Maybe my afternoon class I would have taken virtually, maybe. You're the only one sleeping in that class. <laughs> well, everyone got the question wrong, which means not a single person was even listening to the lecturer. You were doing what everyone wanted to do, so. Exactly. I respect it. Thank you. <laughs> Is there anything else you want to say? No, that's it. I'm done. <laughs> I'm incriminating myself. <laughs> okay. Good night. <laughs>